a circumstance. This reading may play out from the perspective of a cost watcher. This is a timeless reading. It's also very general. So take what resonates only, let the rest go. I'm going to pull some cards for Aries placements, see what the energy is for Aries placements. speaking about something that's unfair, something that is not balanced. This could be a legal situation, something that you're not seeing clearly, lack of clarity. This could be some negative karma that someone is experiencing, okay, or someone that you're connected to is experiencing, or someone that they're connected to is experiencing. But of course, Libra, energy coming through. Um, number 11, uh, is significant and uh, for me you guys know that 11s are about portals so I do feel like this could mean imprisonment right of the mind or or literal um, something uh, possibly um, corrupt taking place all right um, for sure all right so, can't leave the cards out, obviously. So, uh, Justice. What else for Aries placements? Why is Justice in reverse for Aries? Why is Justice in reverse? Aries. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. The Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Alright, so family, family money. This could have something to do with a divorce or um theft. Something's a burden, okay? Something has been a burden. Um, with the Justice card in reverse, it could mean a very lengthy trial or something like that. Um, Ten of Pentacles in reverse is um, Virgo energy. Um, again, uh, the Ten of Pentacles, it, it speaks about family, um, a broken family, possibly, okay? Um, just... A lot of money okay a lot of loss so there's something big at stake at stake here I feel like someone could be losing a lot or with the justice card being in reverse and the ten of uh, Pentacles both in reverse it's like whatever there's some type of accountability that's taking place all right for some type of loss here okay Aries placements justice and the Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles is why the Justice card is in reverse. Why someone is experiencing a lot of karma is, is something connected to family. Um, Like there could be someone that you know with justice and the ten of pentacles in reverse there could definitely be something to do with you know taxes or tax forms or um handling mis mishandling something um that's connected with family this could also have something to do with bad representation okay i'm also hearing something about um um what do you call it CPS, Child Protective Services. So 
me more about the situation for Aries placements. about information or, 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 or something that's um, happening quickly. Maybe, um, I just feel like this could be you, <laughs> Aries, you know, there's, there's a termination here, um, to get where you need to be, to get where you need to go. A lot of enthusiasm, okay? Um, to get a message to someone or to get a point across with the Prince of Wands, all right? And there could definitely be, um, again, a Sagittarius involved in this situation. Um, again, or a fire sign. This could be you, but there's someone very determined to um, to get through something or to get a message through, okay, or to get at something here. We have the Knight of Cups in reverse. Knight of Cups in reverse, okay? In this deck, the Knight of Cups is more like the the the, the, the king, okay? Because it goes princess, prince, knight, and queen. So the fact that this is in reverse, you know, we could be dealing with a a water sign, okay, a cancer of significance, but there is someone, um, masculine energy someone that feels lost or out of control emotionally unable to hold on unable to You know, a lot of times also this 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 knight of um, of cups repressed emotions, re, re, you know, repression of emotions leading to some type of like mood issues or emotional imbalance. You know, I feel like this, whatever this legal matter is, or whatever this karma is, or whatever it is taking place surrounding a loss of money or family, it, um, it could have something to do with, uh, Something okay. So I'm also I'm also getting some type of abuse, okay, with this King of Cups, you know, this Knight of Cups in reverse.
or abusing a situation um, okay what's on the bottom of the deck we have death Pluto, Scorpio energy. So there's definitely a ending here. Um, there's some active corruption going on here all right but i feel like you if you're that that prince of wands you're determined to to end something or to to let something go to heal or to purge some type of negativity that's taking place. The death card could also represent, you know, you know, skeletons in the closet coming out. Or, you know, someone has done something to try to repress, to try and repress what took place in a family or something like that. But with Pluto on the bottom of the deck, I feel like something is, something is done. Or is it the death of the secrets or something like that? Yeah, it's the death of the secrets. It's the death of the secrets. Yeah, right below. The death card, the star card, and the high priestess. the death of the secrets someone's finally gonna get peace in the situation in this trial in this battle whether it's custody or something else um, maybe there's a lot of secrets and uh, you know disturbing things coming out that's been very stressful but at the end of the day, um, someone here is going to be able to charge forward and um, have clarity, right? Star card, peace. But through, it's it's through uh, some type of um, purging or repressed emotions or secrets coming out that this piece is going to be found all right guys so right below that is the six of cups so you know this goes deep you know this goes deep you know something again to do with children or childhood you know that's coming back to be um addressed and ultimately it'll be it'll be healing is what i'm hearing what's the potential outcome for aries what's the potential outcome Seven of Wands. So, Seven of Wands to me is like winning a battle, putting up a good fight, defending what you believe in, standing um, 
up for your for your own you know morals and fighting for the truth you know you know this is again a valiant fight or um yeah someone's gonna have a strong defense or again someone may have been accused of something that they weren't that hadn't done but again this is like real um tough um team you know whether it's a legal team or a group of rallying around you your your angels your guys whatever there's protection here with the valor and the seven of wands okay and then a way opens up there's all the fire a way opens up for you aries there's your energy okay um so patience is a virtue um your ships are coming in so there is movement here there is some, th some type of travel or or um options coming your way um again this is also you know some type of you know channeled energy um or potential right that you took the two of wands um and and now you're at the three so you know whatever downloads you're getting you're able to to, to process them uh to take you to another space um a better place so to speak and let's just give an oracle to end the message for aries aries placements restricted right <laughs> restricted this is this is the energy that you've been in or someone's been in like I said um, there is a death to that you know I feel like to get to that place to get the, to this freedom to get past these blockages and restrictions something someone some force has to be exiled banished um, and let go of completely so that you can become free and again that's that's the energy all right so we want this to take place so something can stop reoccurring right it's like go out walking down the same corridor over and over again right every time I take this car out of the corridor it looks like it's a hospital or um, some type of institution a prison but this could be the mind, right? There are doors in this hallway that have been locked or closed, but now something is opening up, repressed emotions. <laughs>